Greetings and welcome to City Skylines Deep Third, episode 67. In the previous episode, we built the colossal office, colossal office, the colossal office, uh, colossal orders offices over in the uh, left corner over there, and that led us to building the Large Hadron Collider. After the episode, I said, "What should we build next?" And the message in the chat from Chatucker, well, chat in the comments from Chatucker, uh, was to build the uh, Eden Project. So we're going to start the, the get base work to get the Eden Project up and running. So, boop. let's see what we need to get started with the Eden Project. The first thing we need for the Eden Project, which is, I believe, that one. We need to construct the Cathedral of Plentitude, which is going to be in that one. That's just a straightforward cathedral. That, that's the thing. That's a university. Yeah, it's Amsterdam Palace. Uh, cathedral of Plentitude. At least that's one of the far end. City Hall? Where's my cathedral hiding? What is that? Cinema. Uh, it'll be one of these T ones anyway. So it'll be in the right place if we look to the right place. So. We have Meteorite Pack and the Plaza of the Dead. Probably don't want that one so much. Uh, let's, which one looks like a cathedral? Well. That's a tower. What the hell is that? The Cathedral of Blended Dord. Alright, so this is a, a big building I'm going to go with. Apparently clicking that was a bad idea. Can we go and... You have no niceties over here, do you? Aww. So how much would the, uh, the... Can I have the building for that, please? Game? Right, that one, that one, that one you'll do. What about that one? There you go! Now this has a big radius of, of usableness, and it is a cathedral, so it makes sense it would be in the how near the housing area. Um, it does have a noise thing, but the noise thing is actually minimal. Um, can we fit it anywhere down here? No, it looks like it's snapped a long ways on. Uh, that is fine. It won't fit anywhere down here then, because this is again. Oh, maybe we can fit it there if we remove that little tiny bit of road. It's a busy road though. I don't really want to put more on that side, on that road. So maybe this side. This side's got less less stuff. No, it's actually uh, it'll be even hard to fit it in there. Although, if you remove that road, you can fit it there. Welcome to the Cathedral of Plenty, George. Hang on. Bring it down. Look at that for a cathedral, eh? It does all, all look like a Cylon. Da -da -da -da. So uh, it looks a bit like a mixture of a Cylon and a, uh, a Dalek with sharp edges. <laughs> At least that's my view of it. Why are so many people in one lane here? I mean, I gave you a two-lane road. I didn't give you a two-lane road there. Oh, maybe I should give you a two-lane road there. A uh, two-lane road? Uh, that one. Boom. There you go. Have a two-lane road. You can move your vehicles much faster. Also, we really should map this just to get people into the right lanes as early as possible. You. You. There we go. You into that lane there. And you get to go in that lane there. <clears throat> now, you can sort yourselves out later on down the line, by all means. But uh, for now, I just don't want you uh, calling up that entrance piece there. Uh, we probably should make it into a bigger road since it is 2-2, two two, but I feel like a, a three-lane might be better off there. Looking at that, a three-lane going down there would give them a straight and two turns. Ooh, we should do that. Also, frame rate in this area are particularly bad right now. Uh, okay, so we'll do an upgrade for this. One way... Ooh, we can't do that because the building's in there. Okay, uh, do we have any like, really narrow three-lane roads? No, but we have a narrow four-lane road, don't we? A three-lane one-way. Oh, uh, that should fit. That fits! Excellent. There, there. So that should do that nicely. Giving people a lot more room to move. And when they get here, they'll have the three lanes that they're going to be using. Good. And then we could then also just help people out here. Upgrade that. It gives them three lanes to do stuff. And all three should be straightforward. They do. We have appropriate turning lanes. Good. And up here then, we want to quickly change the lane assignments. So they can have... Honestly, at this point, I think they'd be, they would be better off just leaving them alone. Um, I mean, yeah, we get less people stuck on the back roads if we give them a dedicated lane to get into. But they're going to want to change out their... We also want to get rid of these, though. Let's get rid of these. 
The, no, not the hospital. The, we need the hospital. It's the button there went to press. There's no reason for uh, light there. Uh, there's no lights on that one. There should be no lights on that one. No, no, no lights. There we go. So they can free roam down to here. When they get here, they can deal with whatever they're dealing with. Let's just get these vehicles moving at a maximum efficiency here, basically. And that should work out pretty well. Alright, that's one down. Let's uh, move on to the next thing, which is... What's our next thing? Next thing will be, will be, will be, will be... You. We need to uh, construct the official pack. The official pack. That should be a dog pack in all, in all truth. Um, not to mention the fact that this place is doing pretty bad on... Uh, Park areas. Why, 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 why are you red up here on park areas? Come on, you have a pack right there, but it's not a dog pack. Well, I feel your pain, and I will give you a dog pack. There you go. Okay, so the, the official pack, you say? It's back the unicorn pack. No, all right. Uh, that one. What's that? I think that's the thing. Yes. So the official pack should be fairly easy to spot because it could be quite a flat thing like that. Official pack. <laughs> Okay, this is the official pack. It has a small area. We can put this up here, actually. I mean, it might annoy a few people, but screw them. Come on, come on. Boom. Official pack. That should really help people out in this area. We need to get some subway up here as well, which we haven't even touched yet. Next thing for the Eden Project will be the service services offices. You gotta love the good service services. Uh, where would you put a service services office? Would that be a lower tier? Well, that's, if that's a mall, right? Mall of moderation. That one is a kind of disaster memorial, which we can't do yet. These aren't buildings. Meteorite Park and... And... Plaza of the Dead, which we can't do with those yet. So we need a building building. And they're done, apart from that one. Which is a courthouse, so it's not at that level. That one would be the oppression offices, not that one. Uh, so they're going to win these then, isn't it? That looks like an office. Highest interest tower. Nope. I'm guessing it's that one there. The servicing services office. Got to love those services. What do you actually bring anyway? You you bring offices, uh, services. Okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty good resources. We can put this out this way. It would potentially offer services to the, uh, the industry out here. It's massive though. For what it's offering. We could put it there, and it would have a nice beach view to the incoming tsunami. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> would it be mean to put it there? It would probably be mean to put it there, wouldn't it? Boom. I just want to check out the land. Please don't have a big border around you. Please don't have a big border around you. You actually surprisingly don't have a big border around you. That is surprising. Also, you are quite an ugly building. But at least you have a elephant on the roof. Okay, so that's one down. The next building. Oh, we can build it straight away. I was not expecting to complete that entire Eden Project stuff this episode. Well, an Eden Project is a huge glass house perfect for vast gardens full of exotic fruits and plants. It greatly increases its profile and reduces pollution from land, air and water, making the land and city more valuable. Well, I feel that something like that should be in our... Uh, if we can get some frames today, it'd be nice. Thank you. Should be up here if possible, because it makes sense it would be up in our touristy area if it's a big greenhouse. Now, it won't fit up here, where I'd really love it to fit. I might have to do a bit of ground terraforming there. Okay, let's have a look at ground terraformation. Uh, let's see, what's the land looking like here? It is a bit of a steep slope. Okay, well, if we could even this out a bit. Even it out a bit. Ba -ba -ba -ba. More power. Biggest capacity. Uh, leveling tool would probably be the best leveling tool, right? Leveling tool would probably be the best one. Boom, ba doom, ba doom, ba doom, ba doom, ba doom, ba doom, do do. Well, that tried to level it the best it could. And did it do a big enough job? I don't honestly know. Too much soil. Uh, one second, let's go dump some soil somewhere. Uh, there's a little scroll bar, the uh, progress bar on the uh, top uh, side. And it's just emptying that out now because we, uh, the game has a little weird limit where you can only move so much soil. Uh, I'm guessing that filled it up so quickly. Boo, 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 boo. Whoa! Maybe, 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 maybe not that much leveling. That, that, that is, that's not level. 
I just just don't put it that way. That, that that's not that's not level. Could you um, could you come back up, please? Thank you. Much appreciated. Okay, we now have to be careful because we're making a mountain out of a molehill. Eat some of that away, and then we switch to a lower tier. I have got a maximum threshold, so uh, it is more likely to do weird stuff. But you can just come up to there. We just get rid of that hill. There we go. Should we make that level off and bring that up? Hopefully we can get this level enough that the Eden Project building will be able to uh, level it better itself. Bring it up, bring it up, bring it up, 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 up. There we go. And then this piece here. And hopefully that will be sufficiently... Uh, ooh, I see you're trying to do the bit in the middle. Hopefully that will be sufficiently uh, high for the Eden Project to be built. It's a bit rough already, but it might be enough for it to level it. It is... N oh, it can! Right there. Eden Project complete! There it is. One Eden Project. Amazing building. Uh, we'll be putting light bulbs on. There we go. Look at that, eh? Isn't that just glorious? Now, does that have an immediate effect on pollution is the question. So we have all these pollution areas caused by our industries. And it's supposed to reduce or remove pollution. So we have these little spots, and we also have the, uh, where is it, hiding? The, we have the Poop Lagoon over here, or, uh, sorry, Poop Kano. So we're about to find out if it can actually, if it reduces all of those. So, full speed. And let's see, is it reducing the pollution? Is it a rapid reduction, or is it a small, over time reduction? Ground pollution is at 5%. And we are at 3 times speed, so it should hopefully be reducing that. It does look like it's going to be a small over time, because it is staying as it is. Okay, it's fine. Uh, Eden Project, you do good work, okay? Boom. Right, so that's going to hopefully reduce pollution over time. What's our next task on the list? And let's have a look at one of these we can do ourselves. What's the fun one? A space elevator. Okay, that would be potentially useful. <clears throat> okay, space elevator. That was mentioned in the comments as well by uh, Mr. Washington. Uh, we have the fusion power plant, which will solve all of our power problems, although we did just wipe out the money to buy that with. The high interest tower uh, would bring us a load of patients. That would deal with our medical problems, which we don't really have many medical problems. And a doomsday vault, which we can't currently do because we need to make the meteor pack, which you need to have a meteor impact to build the meteor pack. So we can't build that one yet. So I say we target ourselves for the space elevator. We need to construct the expo center, which I believe we're going to be out of cash to build, which is uh, that one there, the green one. Oh, we can build the expo center. Now, if possible, it would make sense it would be up here as well, because it'd be like, hey, come to the exposition center. It's uh, surrounded by amazing stuff. There's a train station there, so that can't go on there. We can have a road going across the train station to the expo. That would make sense, because all expo centers are in the least convenient place you can put them. So, we'll do this. This is the one place we'll do it and never do it anywhere else because I think it's a stupid thing to do in the first place. But we'll have a road come across there and will go across the, the actual railway line. Like that. And it'll just run out there like that. Boom. There we go. Now, for now, it's just going to have one building on it, but uh, we might put more later. It'll have the expo centre. Uh, sat there, half in the mountain. Yeah, makes sense. Boom. Half in the mountain for you. Also, what's the piping out here? No piping out there. Piping! What's the power out, by the way? Power's fine. Good. Yeah, so, my, from my experience, expo centres usually are like, hey, we built this thing out of town where it's going to be really convenient to get to. Oh, by the way, there's now a train track, and there's traffic lights, and there's a one-way system, and all these other things to make it awkward to get to. So, the one place in the city where there's a crossing goes to the expo centre. It makes sense to re replicate lifetime. Uh, what's next on our list of things to build? The stadium. But do we have to have a stadium? I thought we had like a no sports rule. Uh, stadium, 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 stadium. Oh look, we're all out of stadiums. You should be able to build that stadium as a uh, as a as a as an alternative. Just saying. Okay. Well, again, if people are going to be coming to visit stuff, they're going to come up here and they're going to want to go to sports. I hear they're quite popular in some places. Whoa! So, can we fit a sports centre up here? 
One more square. Come on. No. There's a damp pack there that it could have fit because of it. Uh, honestly, if we move that, if we move that over a teeny tiny, weeny whiny little bit, boom, it should make room for the pack. But it's about the stadium. Stadium, stadium. Nobody's gonna let me build a stadium. There it is. Boom. Stadium. Oh, you don't look unhappy. You don't like stadiums either. All right, so we have a stadium. Boom. We have a taxi rank. It's gonna get about to get really busy in that taxi rank. Just saying. All the people. Look at all the people. We are tanking our frame rate today as well, which is. Uh, but I know why the rain makes bad, I just can't do anything about it right now. And then next thing on our list is Statue of Wealth. Now that's going to go in our industry area. We should, where should we put the Statue of Wealth? Ooh. Now that'd be a tier one thing, right? Because it's uh, statues are really cheap to do. Now where would you put a Statue of Wealth? Now, logically, Statue of Wealth would go in sort of... We only in that commercial area. Hang on, I'm, I'm rotated. We don't want to go in that commercial area. Because um, it's not really a, a wealth area. That's more of an entertainment area. It doesn't want to go into the new city, maybe. Uh, that's industry. Ooh. Thank you. It doesn't really fit industry for such a wealth. <clears throat> it's more commercial. Now, there's a big city over here. Big area town over here. There's a big area town over here. We have the oil. Ooh. Such a wealth in the oil district. <clears throat> I feel that would be a good idea. It seems like a stupidish thing to do, but the oil industry is one of the biggest money makers, um, despite the fact that they probably end up killing more people than they make money for. Um, can it fit in there? I don't think it will fit. Is there a building in there? There's a... Is that a fire station there? In that case, put it on that road. Boom. Statue of Wealth. Right by the oil power plants. It makes perfect sense. <laughs> uh, hello, Statue of Wealth. How are you doing? You could have a better face, couldn't you? All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's look at the next thing. I don't want to build too many things. We can build that now. We just need 1.5 million to build that. Well, you know, we could build that. We could have, we could have 1.5 million in no time. We could. We could indeed. Uh, okay, so there's a fire there. I can see it. It is. It is gone now. I could see it. It's gone. Now. Anyway, so let's look at our things we're gonna build. I want to do one more episode of uh, achievement building from these before we expand this middle town piece here again. So next time round, I think we're gonna go for the fusion power plant. Um, we can't do that one. We can't. We could do that medical center but I feel we should be looking at the fusion power plant to go up on the hill <coughs> with the uh, collider whereas the space elevator it wants to be somewhere central um, how big is it by the way it's huge okay it wants to be over here then sort of like hey look at us we're building them to the moon yeah that makes sense but so we're gonna need a million for that so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna run the game just like run forward off camera to build up to the uh, the 1.5 million that we need. So at the beginning of the next episode, we will be building the space elevator and then beginning work towards the fusion power plant. Once we have those, we'll then use some money for the next episode after that to expand this piece of town or city here and build out this section here to have more places and ideally move these offices to this end and make this more room for more houses. And this wants to be houses ideally with the offices over here. That's kind of my plan to have this as an office section. But that'll be all for the next time. Until then, comment in the comments. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.